right, Mark's calling me over here. Dave and Robert over there. Mark's over here saying he's got a complete buckle. He probably means shoe buckle, I'm hoping. But we'll see what he's got. Shoe buckle, Mark? With a plain frame or got some... It's got design on it? Oh, yeah, nice. Very nice. It might even operate still. Oval. Oh, yeah, that's beautiful. minutes in. Dave's got a copper already. Ten minutes in. You said it was low 70s? Yeah, but it was ringing like button in the hole, so there's probably iron in there. Yeah, it's probably KG, yep. Yeah. KG2. Seem to be getting a lot of those lately. I know, right? It's like going streaks. Five last week. Yeah. Nice man. KG2, 10 minutes in. Congrats. Thanks. Oh, wait. Oh no, a shoe buckle frame. Yeah, it's ringing up mid 40s. Shoe buckle frame. It's an old one, too. You got macro on that, Robert? Yeah. That's good. Awesome. One of the old ones. Yeah, nice. wonder why stuff ran so long. A shoe buckle frame. Uh, part of the shape, iron tongue and shape, that's why. And a nail. Dave, it was iron tongue and shape and a nail in there. That's why it's so low. But Dave says he got something in the same hole as his copper. <laughs> yeah. Knee buckle? Yeah. That's cool. No, I, I pulled out a nail. That's why the copper was ringing low. Then I just I rechecked the hole with the pinpointer, and that came up. Oh, I think unless it's a D buckle. No, it's, well, a, no, it's a knee that's buckle. Me, yeah. Yeah. Small one. Might got be. a KG two. He's got a shoe buckle frame. Nice. What do you got? Button. He's got the iron tongue shoe. I yeah. think I just uh, got one over here. Oh, awesome. Sweet. You got a pattern on. It looks like it. Yeah, it's, I can see some yeah. dots. Oh yeah, absolutely. Oh, yeah, that's, awesome. that's a nice pattern, actually. Yeah, it's got like a feather. Rope pattern. It's in the same hole. It's white. In the same hole. Yeah, I pulled the copper, then a, uh, a square nail, then and that. And then that. Yeah. How's the copper? Nice shape? Not bad. Yeah, it's pretty good. Okay, this has got a nice, like, rope pattern on it. It's real nice, man. Nice. I haven't seen one like that. It's nice. So Robert's calling me over right now. He says he's got a copper. Bugs are coming out. It's getting warm. Been here about half an hour. Let's see what Robert got. Robert has. <clears throat> I think it's a KG? Yeah, Yeah. You can pull it out if you want. Nice. It's only a couple inches, huh? Yeah, right at the bottom. Yeah. To get in the sunlight. Dave, move a little bit. 
Yeah, yeah perfect. <laughs> <laughs> this side looks pretty slick, but yeah, it's hard to tell, Robert. Let this side dry yeah. out. You might get an idea on this side. Congrats, man. Thank it's probably you. a KG. Good job, bro. Thank you. Uh, so what's what's uh what's on your bucket list for copper still that you haven't found yet? Ooh. I want 1600s. Yeah. William the Third. Didn't your dad get one of those? Yeah. Yeah. So he's ahead of me, but I still have you get you get, you get any Fujios or Constellations? Not yet. Nova uh, Nova's definitely up yeah. there. It's a beautiful coin. Yeah. You'll mm. get it, man. You'll get it. Yeah. Getting a low VDI right here. Looks like a button. Tom back. Yeah, I man. I wanted like to this. come here. He's like, no, no, we're saving it. What do you got? I don't know what it is. That, it's eh? some type of buckle, yeah. I, I feel like I've seen that. Yeah, like I see a crossbar on the end with the, see the time? Is that a rain guy? I don't know. It's not a rain guy. No, I see a bar right there on yeah. top. That's got But look really... at the design of it. Yeah. Is it a broken in half like spectacle buckle? I don't know. Definitely a buckle. That's cool. Wow, that's pretty unique, dude. Yeah. I've never seen one like that. See the shape of that, the design of the end? It looks like something like the side plate of a musket. See how that? Yeah, man. Yeah, that's that's cool. pretty yeah. ornate, man. Yeah. That's nice. Never seen I one never like that. I never did either, man. That's got to be something special. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Got the yeah. screw holes. Look at it. See that the, that design matches the buckle. Yeah. Yeah, it does. So yeah, Mark just dug this up. It's it's like a sidebar or side plate to a musket. Yeah. Some Brown. perfect shape too. Brown bass maybe. Got the screw hole there and there. A little bit little ding there. Yeah. Oh, see that? See right here? There's an arrow there. Nice. Put I wonder if it's back. got a number on got it. A big, we got a Another mid 70s. Full bar every angle. Right next to the outer wall. I think it is. No, it's a buckle. Knee buckle. Cool. Oh, it's got the anchor chip. Looks like it's got like a... Yeah. Tongue is broke. That's yeah, still nice. It's got the old anchor chip on it. Probably like 1730s, 1740s. Cool. So what I got here is one of the old 1700 two-piece buttons. And we always just find the backs of them. And they, co they come together at the seam. But this one's complete. And it's really rare to find them like this. They're, they're similar to blowhole buttons. But they just don't have the blowholes in them. And the blowhole was actually a good idea because it kept them from coming apart. That these were them without the blowhole buttons. And normally this top face would just pop off. You see where it's seamed together. But it's pretty rare to find them 100% intact. So really cool. All right, Mark's calling me over there. Dave and Robert over there. Mark's over here saying he's got a complete buckle. Probably means shoe buckle, I'm hoping. But we'll see what he's got. It's got a design on it. Oh yeah, nice. Very nice. Oh, yeah, that's nice, man. It might even operate still. Oval. Oh. Yeah, that's beautiful. 
a nice pattern on it. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, it's complete. Look at the tongue. It's probably still gonna work just like my other one that I found. It feels a little stiff. Yeah. That's beautiful, man. Wow. Is that your first complete one? No, my second. I just yeah. had one a couple weeks ago. Nice. That was perfect. <laughs> perfect. A couple months ago. <laughs> perfect <laughs> condition. Years. Yeah. Look at that thing. That's awesome. Yeah, my other one still works. I mean, it's comp I mean, as soon as I pulled it out of the hole. Yeah, it still it, operates. Yeah, everything started working. Yeah, the, out. we got a couple like that, but not many. They're usually gummed up, you know. Yeah. Soaking in, soaking in WD-40. It might loosen up though. You never yeah. know. Yeah. Feels a little stiff, but yeah. Right, still, even that. like that, it's beautiful. In a high 70 DDI. 80. About six inches. Oh, I see it right there. Yeah. It's thick too. It might be a Connecticut. Yeah. I can see an NIA. So definitely KG2. Seems like all the coppers out here are KG2s. But that, the reverse has got really good detail. 1740 something. 